Yo guys, what's up? It's uh, TX Grizz here, and coming at you with yet again favorite series here, the nudist, <laughs> the Naked Gun series, and uh, today we've got a Naked Gun. It is the AK-47. I'm using in this um, just the usual uh, sleight of hand, quick draw, dead silence, and specialist perks are uh, scavenger because this thing runs out of ammo like there is no tomorrow hardline and uh, the last perk I think is like assassin or something I mean last perk really don't matter to me too much and uh, today we'll, I actually almost got a MOAB with this class wall in, in this gameplay I mean I, you could say almost I think I was uh, like 16 what it was and um yeah, I mean, I, I, went, I did pretty good. It was a 30 and 5 going at the end of the game. And, yeah, there you go. I finally brought the series back. I told y'all I was going to try to come back in full force, and I didn't have the game. I didn't have a game or anything today. So, here you go. Uh, that shotgun guy was aggravating the shit out of me this whole game. And you can see, I got my two kills, got my scavenger. Get this guy the portable radar. Now, guys, the portable radar is really I, I like it a lot, especially when trying to get Moabs or whatever, or just trying to get kill streaks in general. The mo the uh, wow, the my aim failed me like really, really hard on that one. And I'll wait right here and get a double kill. Doop, doop, sit down. I mean, you kind of saw that coming. I knew he was coming. So yeah, sit right down. And knowing you, mo what most people do, I turn around and go to this uh, corner over here because I figured they would push from the backside. So you're gonna see me lay here for a second. And guy comes, get all seven on, get my specialist perks. But uh, again, the portable radar, the portable radar is a very, very good uh, equipment. Especially, I mean, even when people have assassin, you still you watch the mo what most people are doing. So if you have a, you can put it in a corner somewhere where like this you can put it at a choke point where the radius just reaches the tip of uh over here and with the, this the porta potty area where i'm looking at right now it's over on the other side and about where the bomb site would be where b bomb site if y'all play search and destroy enough on that side it about reaches the corner of that i'm trying not to die right here almost almost got shot in the head with a noob tube um, it about reaches the corner of that, so you know if someone's coming that direction, and also it's keeping the whole pipe watched. Right here, I'm trying to play a little more defensive, and I know they're going to be coming from this way. But, you know, I wanted to try to bring you guys a Moab on the uh, Naked Gun series. There you go. Get that one guy, run over here. I don't. I looked at my ammo, didn't need to pick up the scavenger pack, and hit him with the sit down. Come around the corner, get him just barely, and guy sitting in the corner. I was so raging pissed, it's not even funny. This guy actually ended up being my nemesis in this game. He killed me twice. And yeah, I was, I was kind of angry about that. Anyway, now I'm, I'm pushing forward, trying to see if, hey, maybe I can get another one, another streak going. And we're on this corner. I come around here, shoot him, get the one kill, and then I don't know what just happened. See, I told you the guy killed me. Again, walk around, just aim it on a sight of stalker. It is just it is aggravating as shit. Oh, and my final, my third perk for the uh, specialist tier on here actually is a uh, steady aim, which steady aim is pretty good for an AK. The AK is uh, it has again just like every other uh, Call of Duty has a lot, a lot of kick to it, but it's pretty, it's pretty strong and pretty accurate as far as you know just single shot and it goes. But the only bad thing is that's why my uh, <coughs> you'll you'll guess it. That's why my first specialist perk is a uh, scavenger. The ammo, like you can't run through. I wanted to try to. I I just remember that I wasn't supposed to use lethal kill streaks with this anyway. But um, you can't kill a whole lot of people with the amount of ammo that you're given. You're only given one clip and sixty spare bullets, and. It just to me with the AK because of its amount of kick, you cannot sit there and kill a lot of people with it. I think I've only gotten three people maybe with one clip. I got lucky right there. Oh, that dude's aim was piss poor. Kind of like mine earlier, but hey, I can't really complain. 
But so yeah, if you're gonna run with an AK, you should more than likely run scavenger as a specialist perk. I wouldn't really say as the uh, first perk on your like your main setup because you also you really do need to have a uh, sleight of hand. So you know, run it either way, but you need to have sleight of hand or if you can get it extended mags. Because if I could have used extended mags on here and I had it, I would have because extended mags works very very well with the AK. You just have to try and you're trying to lay off the trigger a little more. As I did right there, I had to, had him in a little bit of a distance. Uh, I have all my specialist perks. I wasn't paying attention to the score. I was more trying to get this guy to that corner. You see me creep and come back, and I just hold down the trigger because it, its rate of fire is—it's faster than the CM901. So you know it's not that bad. Come around the corner, turn, and oh, the game's over. But yeah, guys, there's your naked gun series for the week, and uh, this has been TX Grizz. Hey, look, be Dewitt. All right, follow me on Twitter, guys, for some more updates. I'm, I told you I'm coming back full force. I'll talk to you guys later. 30 and 5 with three assists.